Dunkin' Donuts Center has been the Providence Friars' home since 1972, providing the team with a home court experience that rivals any environment in the country. However, the 2020-2021 season took place all at Alumni Hall due to the COVID pandemic, which kept the team away from the Friar faithful. So we had the COVID pause nationally. Then we come back the following year and we are in arenas and Alumni Hall with no one there. Keeping us, you know, the safety of our fans and our student body was important. And we understand that. That's why we, we understood why we had to play at Alumni Hall. Uh, with no fans. Playing in alumni was cool last year, but we didn't have any fans. And so it was a little different. Guys like Nate and Noah came back for a fifth year to play in front of the home crowd, while newcomers Al Durham and Justin Minaya were looking forward to experiencing that atmosphere for the very first time. I heard it gets really loud. I heard it's really hard for the opposing teams to win there. That is hard for people to win in there. It's really hard for people to win there and that the fans are electric. Going off campus to a big arena like the Dunk sits over 10,000 people. It's only something I could have dreamt of growing up. They bring a different approach to the game, hearing them yell their chants and just feeling that energy that they give. Um, sometimes they scream so loud, I can't even hear myself think, can't hear myself talk. And so but that's, that's what we love. Almost immediately, when things tipped off in November, the Dunk experience was back to what it was before the pandemic. And then bang, back to normalcy with attendance. Providence men's basketball in the dunk is like peanut butter and jelly. We go hand in hand. The Dunkin' Donuts Center is one of the best places to play in the country. The students, first of all, 1,800 to 2,000 students per game. Then you have all of our season ticket holders. Then the community support. You couldn't ask for a better home court advantage in all of college basketball. The minute you walk in that back door, the energy you feel, the goosebumps you get. I just feel like everything's so close. Like you got fans sitting courtside and then even the fans that are, you know, behind the benches or higher up, you know, they, they just feel so close to the game that, you know, they're pretty much a part of it and they, they make the dunk experience what it is. Having their presence there and them being loud, cheering, clapping, screaming, yelling, it gives you a, a feeling that you can't really describe, but also just makes you feel like they're there with you, like they're on the court with you. I like how, how even though it's not the biggest campus, it's not the, it's not the biggest school, it's that the dunk still gets packed in and it, and it shows how, how really smart of a, and big of a basketball fan base this really is. I feel like we have the best stadium, we, we have the best atmosphere, and every game is getting sold out. So that just lets you know right there that we gotta be doing something well, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Thank you to our community for making Providence College and the Dunkin' Donuts Center one of the toughest places in all of college basketball. We've had unbelievable crowds at the dunk, and so we can't thank them enough for helping us reach this point. Just being in any old arena, this arena comes with a lot of magic, I think. For the PC Hoop Show, I'm Nick Rojas. <laughs>